All right, all right, all right. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Monday night or night with J2 the Dilla. Hope you guys are having a beautiful Monday night. Hope you guys are enjoying your day. It's just going to get better with this. So, we're going to start a whole new game, all new season, all new episode, same game on Resident Evil 1, but this time, instead of Chris, we can go with Jill. It's going to be a couple different scenes, different bosses. We're going to find out different bosses, but different boss fights, I should say. But uh, it's going to be amazing. Hope you guys get ready. You all know the routine. Get your popcorn, get your drinks ready. We're about to start this in just one minute. Alpha Team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of their Chris, mission. Have found it yet? No, not yet, Brad. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris! Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. We continued our search for the other members, and it turned into a nightmare. This way. There are only three STARS members left now. Captain Wesker, Barry, and myself. We don't know where Chris is. What is this place? Not quite your ordinary house, that's for sure. Hey, Wesker, where's Chris? Jill, no. You don't want to go back out there. But we've got to find... What was that? 
Chris? No. Jill, go and investigate. I'm going with her. Chris and I go back a long way. All right. You two go. I'll secure this area. Stay sharp. <clears throat> A dining room. Yes, the dining room. Let's grab this. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the horror survival. I think you'd better take a look at this. What is it? Blood. It's ketchup. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. Let's just hope it's not Chris's. Just some ketchup and some Tabasco sauce, bro. Some yum yum. The yum yum juice. Someone was enjoying the dinner. Oh no. Zombie. The original zombie. Barry! What is it? Look out! It's a monster! Let me take care of it! Oh, he took three magnum shots. That bad monster what the is a hell is this thing? I found Kenneth killed by this thing. Let's report this to Wesker. That is a G. That <laughs> zombie just got up and left. He's like, I don't like you guys. You guys are cool, man. Jill, help me look for him, but let's not leave this hall. Good idea. Better finish the search in the hall first, or else. Barry. Any luck, Jill? No, nothing. What's going on around here? I can't figure it out. Same here. Chris, and now Wesker. There's not much we can do. We can search for him separately. I'll investigate the dining room again. Okay, then. I'll try the door on the other side. <sighs> this mansion is gigantic. We could easily get lost. Let's start from the first floor. Okay. Oh! I almost forgot. It's a lockpick. Nice. You'd make better use of it. All right. Thanks. I may need it. Listen, if something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Got it? Okay. Okay, I had a question. Can we go upstairs to the second? I know she said, I know they said to start with the first floor, but... 
locked sword. Okay. Okay. Oh, you know what? Darn it. We can't. Well, I can I can drop. Oh my goodness. Alright, let's poof. I thought he was on the other side. Goodness gracious. I might have just showed a a way not to get caught by that zombie. I showed I showed the people some uh new glitches. Uh, let's start from the first floor. Come on. God, it's so hard to turn in this game. Alright. So we're dedicated to the first floor. We're not gonna go to that second. I think we've been. Um, I guess we're dedicated. So we'll start with this with the side now. Whatever they say. Let's do what they say. Yes, I did. No, we're not going to put it back. We're going to leave it as is. We're going to come down all the way here. Grab this dagger. Right, right, right. We're going to try to dodge this guy. We can do it if we put our back into it. We can't. We effed up. We effed up bad. Where are you going, Jill? Oh, you need to start running. Oh my goodness. My goodness. Let's go back in there. We effed up. We literally just picked up that dagger to get caught. Let's check out a light, by the way. It says we're fine, but who knows. It's locked emblem of sword. So we really did need to go to the, f to the other side. And not this side. So whatever Barry and Jill said to do, don't do it. Do not listen to these two fools. Okay. So that we screwed up. All right. We're not going to waste our ammo on this zombie in the hallway. We'll wait for later. You're going to grab these two greens. And we're going to grab the ammo.
for a second that there was a zombie here. I'm just freaking out for no reason. And... Let's combine these two. And I know there's two zombies to the left. And that's why we need to go for the, uh... Combine it now, so we don't have to do it during the game. Okay, so this guy is down. Okay. Let's examine it. This guy back to Let's bring him back to the other side. So they can die on top of each other. We can burn one of them. And we can burn two stone, two birds and one stone. And kill two birds with one stone kind of thing. You'll see later on what I mean. the other side pick up the ammo yes sir thank you sir lock the other side there we go we unlocked it this is the door that I wanted to get in the first place when I came through trying to push that um, stone down the dagger come around That was close. That was close. Okay. Go through here. Come on, bro. Oh, 
Up the other side. Yo, zombie. Get your ass over here. a beautiful shot right to the dome pick up the shells there we go Talks about the four masks, evil masks, trust me. It's all evil. Evil and darkness. Okay, we got the sword key. Let's reload. sword let's go over here because I believe in that room in this hallway we can get the we can pick up the lighter Wow, that guy is a beast. Armor key. Socks on the other side. Yes. Look at them. Yes, we will. Thank you. And we'll pick up the lighter. 
Thank you. Story, story, story. Books and books. Okay. Bro, get down. Goodness gracious, that guy would not go down. Okay, let's put this away. Pink ribbon up here. We'll use this right now to burn them. Oh my goodness. <sighs> Get out of here. Let's get out of here. And I know there's another zombie over there. So we're not going through there. We can get we'll go get that shotgun. Wow. Let's see if we can get that shotgun. I do now. Wesker! Barry! Help! Jill! You in there? Barry? Get me out of here! The door's jammed! Stand back! <clears throat> Grab my hand! <clears throat> Saved by Barry. Barry, 
That was a close one. A second late, you would have fit nicely into a sandwich. Really? Thanks. But Barry, didn't you say you were going back to the dining room to find other clues? I'm glad and all, but why are you here? I just had something I wanted to check. Anyway, we should get back to searching for Wesker and Chris. Thanks, Barry. I owe you one. Don't mention it. Okay. Smash his face, Jill. Yeah. Smash. Hey, can we burn his body? Oh, we can. Yes, we can. So we don't get no crimson head. Um. Should we go? There's gonna be dogs out there, but I'm not sure. Are they gonna come out? Guess not. We did good. We filled our uh, oil, so we can burn some of these mother lovers. Hmm. Was that a good choice? Because we don't have any space to do anything. <laughs> We are on caution. Can't combine this anymore. So we should go back this way. Okay. There you go. That's one down. All right. No zombies at the bar. That's always a good sign. We'll put let's put this away. And
Let's see if we can burn some more zombies. I'm not sure where they're at. There you are. Wasted too much ammo right there. Let's bring this guy next to this guy so we can burn him together. It's much better. Alright. And at least burn this guy. See what we got here. Lap the fireplace. Refill that oil, kerosene. put that knife away really but we'll save it ah uh, you know what let's put it away let's put this knife away If I go through that door again, it's going to break, so we're going to go around. Unlocked it. That's good. Good to know. Thank you. Something else? Nope. Okay. Now, 
And I do remember a dog whistle. Over here. And get that. For Spencer, if you guys want to read it, go ahead and pause and read it. Basically, telling us to go to this place, blow the whistle, so the dog will come out, and then on the dog's neck, they have some some item. Once we kill the dog, we can actually retrieve the item, which is our intention to do. It's our goal. Armor key. Burn him. Armor key. And we'll burn him. Go back and refill the kerosene. I think there's a little bit left in that room. It's for like one, one more use, I believe. So, once we're done with this room, we don't have to come back for it. Unless we gotta stash something. But by then, we'll have other stashes around. So far, all we got is this room, so I'm trying to use it as much as we can. Especially with this kerosene. Not a single drop, okay. So there's no more. We got one use. Push this? No. Nope. It's all right, all right. Oh. Barry. Who? Jill. Got any good news? Other than I'm still alive in this madhouse? No. Can't say it's much safer here either. We'd better secure our escape route first. There's gotta be a back door somewhere. All right then, let's split up again. Hey, hold on a sec. Look what I've found. What? A can of fizz. It's sure to yellow and mellow those things. It's yours. Hopefully you won't have to use it. Oh, nice. What about you? Oh, don't worry. I like the buddy system we have here. I see. Thanks, I'll take it. See you later. Ciao. I use spell chow. But okay. Um should we hit the first floor? I doubt that we can get through here. It's locked armor. Locked on the other side. I know there's a zombie out here that we could burn. Hope he's not a crimson head already. Um, I guess they're both gone. Okay. Scratch that.
Let's go this way first. Give me a second, guys. I'll be right back. I'm going to restroom real fast. I'll be right back. Alright guys, so we got the dog whistle. We really need to go to... Darn it. I'm saying darn it because we have no room to put anything away. One sec. Oof. Get the heck out of me, bro. Take that. Thank you. And there's ammo that I can't pick up, though. Darn it. Darn it, darn it, darn it. We'll just have to go put that asset thing away. That's it. That's all we can do. Are those hogs gonna come back? I hope not. I hope the dogs don't attack this time either. Oh yeah, he did. He jumped down. Poof, we're so lucky. Well, I mean, there is plenty of um, meds over there. So they did decide to attack me. Bathroom's clear.
gotta go back to this stash house. Put away their acid rounds. But if I come back through this door again, it's gonna break the doorknob, so... As much as it hurts me to say it, but we have to go all the way around again to pick up that ammo. Which I hate to do. Let's see what else we can put away. Anything else, really? Okay. I never really did like the Crimson Head thing when they come back as Crimson Head. Not because it's more difficult, it's just, I don't know. I guess because I'm the original, I played the original Resident Evil. And they just added that to it, and it just doesn't make sense to me. I don't know. But, oh well. You know? Whatever. One sec, I'm gonna check out the map. Let's see what doors. Okay. The second floor. Ah, okay, you know what? We have one more door for the sword, I believe. And that's gonna take us to the other stash box. So we should use it ASAP. And then after that, we'll get rid of the sword key. On to the next key. Where you picked up the sword, I mean the dagger. All we need is this. There we go. So now we literally can go. Yeah, we can go do the um, dog whistle. I think we did it all. Something else. It's going to be to the left. Okay. See if I stuck on the other side. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. You're right. I forgot these freaking. Oh, I hope they're not crimson now. It's 
been a while. I totally forgot about these zombies. these zombies here let's hope they're not crimson because if they are crimson it's gonna be a fun fun night hello hope you guys are not crimson Oh, nice. Nice. Two, two birds and one stone. Eat that. I'm burn. Burn, baby, burn. And we're still fine. That's what I'm talking about. That is why it's a good idea picking up those daggers. That is why it's a great idea, picking up those daggers. It's locked on the other side. Hmm. I think we can open them from the other side then. Let's go in this room real quick. I know. Ooh, nice. I know there's really not much we can do in this room, but as long as we highlight it and we've been there, I just want to do it real quick. Because we can't really do much until we get the key, the replica. It's always good to just come around, click on the doors. So on the map, it shows we've been there. It's a little thing that I still do since Resident Evil 1 original. Okay. That's a good thing that these guys did not go crimson on me. Okay. Let's see if, let's see if there's anything here. Nope. There wasn't really nothing on Chris. Um, Chris playthrough, but sometimes stuff changes. You never know. Wait, that wasn't the last door for the sword key? What else were we needed for? I could swear that was the last thing. Hmm. Oh, you know what? That's all you forgot downstairs. The kitchen basement. Mm-hmm. Okay. So this is where the um the doggies will come. Right. Let's 
go. Let's go and do this, get this over with. I believe this spot is the best spot. Right here. Oh, shiznit. Stabby, stabby. Okay. That was brilliant. I mean, we did get hit once, but still. That was amazing. We can't pick up the collar because there's no more items, but if we go through here... You've unlocked it. And it's gonna say you probably don't need this twist discarded, yes. And we, we're gonna go out and come back in. So we can pick up that, um... So we can pick up the collar. And grab the armor key, the shield key, shield key. Not sure which. All right. Yeah, it's the armor key. Ta da. So this is the imitation of the key, the one that we can go get, the real one. All is good. In the neighborhood. Okay. Let's heal ourselves. We got three ammos for the handgun. We got plenty for the shoddy. Let's go with the shotgun. He just headshot his ass. There we go. Now we got an empty spot. Yes, we have an empty spot. So now... Hello. Slogged helmet. There's gonna be a zombie down there. And there's gonna be a zombie. Let's, let's, let's finish this guy out. There we go. Let's go down here. There's that zombie. Unfortunately, we don't have any kerosene in this stash house. See, there's nothing else? Huh. Huh. It really isn't. Okay. 
Okie dokie. I don't think we're gonna need the light anytime soon. I don't think so. So we'll put the lighter away. And we shall go to... Next door. This room has the kerosene. So, that's good. What's that? Battery pack. Uh, I'm just gonna wait on that. Oh, that's the broken shotgun. We'll take that. Not that we need that ribbon, but just so we can clear the room. So the broken shotgun is going to be left there. We don't, we're not going to use it because we already got the shotgun. And now come over here and burn this sucker. <gasps> I need my lighter. Totally forgot about it. And the battery pack, it's for the self-defense. Okay. Now I know. So we do need the lighter. Because I do... Use the uh, oil. Some players don't really do the uh, burn the zombies. They just kind of dodge them and pass them, you know? Why not? But I'm not as good as that. I'm not that pro. Okay. So we got one more use. We'll refill it. Might as well. Pick up this broken shotgun. So this way... This room can be cleared. So you can show all green. Just like that. I'll we'll put the broken shotgun away. Can we discard it? Nope. Can't discard it. Okay. Mm. And now we need to go to the basement kitchen. That's going to have a lot of zombies there too. So, oof, oof, oof. Um, that's plant 42. Hmm. It's gonna take us in first floor. Yeah, that's gonna take us right to the place we want to be. And if there's any zombies here, we'll try to. The. Okay, never mind. Guess we have to go all the way around.
chest locked, helmet key. This is going to take us back. Locked it. Perfect. Because this will take it to the armor key. I'm going to need that anyways. this up first It's a helmet? Yeah, it's a helmet key. Okay. So we're done with this room too. Now we need to head to the kitchen down basement so we can eliminate the uh discard the uh sword key. Should be this way. And the crows are here. Don't hear anything. There's a zombie there. Okay, I totally forgot about this zombie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's talk on the other side. Hello? Mister? I dodge him. I just got one battery charge. Bro, this guy is not even paying attention. Should I run it? Oh, I should have, yeah, I should have ran it. No. I just have to bad. I just have to bad. That's that's a waste of ammo. That is completely waste of ammo. Yep. Encounter made of a plant, blah, 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 like wine. What is he? I was going to say, like, why isn't she? We can't pick this up. Yes, we can. Yes, we can. Because... Yes. Because once we get rid of that key... Once we discard that key...
we'll be able to... We'll have another space so we can pick up anything we want. And this is the kitchen basement I was telling you guys about. With the sword key. So for the use for the key discarded, yes we should. So now we got another empty spot. Voila. But there's a couple zombies in here, man. It's not just one. I got three shots of shotgun. Three shots of the ammo. Of a handgun. So... There is handgun ammo in here too, though. That's for sure. There is handgun ammo. So let's go inside. Because I was, I was still really thinking, like, should we... Is it, is it even worth it going in here? Or not. This is completely different than... Okay, so there's a dagger we can use. Stock on the other side. So there's no dead zombies. Like Chris's. In Chris's version, there's like hella zombies here. In Jill's version, there's really none. Just this one here. Okay. And I'm pretty sure one zombie is going to come down from here. And we can dodge him. That's not a problem. Like so. Okay. But now that we have the armor key, give me one second. Okay. We need to go back and refill our oil, put away that music note. We still need ammo, guys. We still need freaking ammo. I mean, a lot. You know what I mean? A lot. Okay. One sec, one sec. Okay. So second floor. Where are we right now? We're on the first floor. First floor. We still can go to the top. Mm. Okay. Okay. Let's talk on the other side. We go through here. We can go up 
and go back down and go around and open that door. You know, I've never messed around with those crows, but do you get something like by killing them if you shoot at them or something with a handgun? I never did get to find out. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. He came from where? He came from the doggy place? Hmm. Huh. From the... That's odd. I don't know how we got there in the first place. Okay, let's put the note away. We are really running low of ammo. Real kerosene. So we got this place for the kerosene, and we got the other outside by the dogs. Not a single drop left. Okay, so we're done from this room. So we only got the dog place outside. Hmm. Battery. Take that. So we got here. Okay. Let's go this way. Nothing. That's a zombie for sure. Oh, the gemstone place, huh? We don't have none of them. Well, actually, we do have the blue one that's laying down the hall room. The main, I mean, the lounge room, whatever. Dining room. The main one. So we could use that. But not right now. Burn, baby, burn. And you thought you could trick me, huh? Ooh, finally got ammo. Finally got ammo. Nice. Let's actually switch to that. So we can save that shotgun ammo. Nothing. Ooh, ooh. We all know it's zombie in there, boys and girls, but should we kill it? That is the question. Should we waste our time? 
going to read it. Pause and read it. Itchy, scratchy, itchy, tasty. We all know what happened. In this place, I wonder what's... Hmm, should we kill it? That's the question. Nice. Another battery. That was worth it. One shot, one ammo for the battery. It's green, so that means we completed the room. Now... You've unlocked it. There we go, baby. There we go. So now that means we can grab this blue gem. And then put in the, uh, the socket of the lion. And get ourselves a reward, baby. All right.
Okay. So we just need to go through here. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. And I believe we're going to pick up one of the masks over here anyways. Punch flavored Gatorade? Come on, bro. That's what you're into. Uh, let's pick up this mask. And all these medics, meds can wait till later. Zombies. Zombies, zombies, zombies. Okay. Now we can put this away. Okay. I really don't want to go kill those zombies. I really don't. But... Just put the HP, you know, to grab them and put them back here. But we'll wait on that. Because we still got some more doors open. You know? And I believe that's going to be in level 2. Mansion, yeah. Hello. Bye bye. Okay. So we're over here. Let's go to the other side. And I believe over here is where we find our dead friend. Huh. Yeah. that up there he is oh we got the nade launcher too <sighs> Boris has given up the ghost looks like he's been dead for a while
Those meds are not really worth it. But we did pick up the right nade launcher. So that is a A plus for me. Let's not go over here just yet. Oh yeah, I remember this. I'm gonna be right back, guys. I'm gonna go take another pee pee. Another pee pee break. Be right back. I've been just been drinking so much water. Darn it. Be right back. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm back. Let's solve this puzzle. If I do remember correctly, it was... Shield, axe, sword. What? What? Come on, crazy. Alright, now I just start from the beginning. That's a, a shame. I thought you just follow the pictures on the wall. That would have been it. Guess I'm wrong. Yeah, I think this is it. This is it right here. We got it. We got it. 
Yeah. Okay. Oh, press the button. Forgot. <gasps> we can't pick it up. No, no. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, no. What a shame. What a shame. Well, we'll just leave that there for now. We'll go open up uh, one more door so we can get rid of the armor key. We can come pick up that key. It's okay. It's cool. It's fine. All is good. Guard it. Um, let's see what's in here first. I think this is the, uh, the room, the gem, if I remember correctly. Oh. Ah. Jill. Barry, I didn't mean to get you that excited. Right. Anyway, you should read this. Um, uh, I have tried to survive only to see you again, but my efforts only delayed inevitable. I'm infected, there's no cure for what will follow except that. Yeah, I've read this before. If you guys want to read it, go ahead and pause and read it. What do you make of it? Well, I guess we were right about this mansion being quite unnatural. You have a way with understatements. Where's the part that's torn off? Well, my only guess is that it was the most important part and somebody didn't want anyone to see it. Let's continue our investigation. Right. Oh no, not this again. I gotta put away... I need some space. Gotta go and put away the stuff first. Let's check out the other side. There's two doors. Let's see what this side's got for me. Nothing. Ink ribbon. No, I'm good. Is there anything besides ink ribbon? This is green. I'm good. Alright, I guess we'll be back. Um, yeah. We're gonna have to go and drop that RPG. Let's pick up this thing with us. Might as well. So we're gonna have to pick up two things when we come back. Ooh, nice. First aid. Let's go. Okay. 
Oh, so we got rid of that key too. So we really don't have any more keys, okay. And it's a good thing that we have our stash box right down here. Not that far. Oh, it's a Wesker note. Oh, he gave us some stash. He gave us some goodies. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's put away this stuff first. Let's put away our grenade launcher. Let's put away the med kit. First aid kit. And... Put away the lighter for now. And the oil. Keep these up here. Take that herb thingy over there. This way, we go back, pick up all these items that we just left. We can pick them up in one run. You know? over here let's move that down acid rounds okay now let's go pick up all those items This should be a quick run, you know, it's right there. Alright, first one to pick up is this. And let's come over here and complete this task. Combine these two. Come back here. Right there. Put that up there. There we go. Oh, shizzle. Forgot about that. Forgot about that. Let's get the hell out of here. Totally forgot about that, B. Let's go in this room and pick up everything else. here all right let's combine these and donski yep 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 that is that boys and girls so far we finished the sword key the armor key we need the shield key and the helmet key. OK. 
Okay. Put this up here with the rest. Alright boys and girls, that's going to be it for today. We hit the two hour mark, as always. Try not to go too far, more than two hours. So you guys can enjoy when you watch it. You have just like a movie, you know? Eat something, drink something with while watching me. Playing these horror ass games. So you guys can have, you know, just enjoy it. Nothing too much. But as always, boys and girls, I appreciate you being here. As always, love you. Until next time, guys. Be cool. Be safe. Peace out. Dad.